Now, we've been looking at a whole host of reshuffling going on in first the governors, then the cabinet, and now in the powerful cabinet committees as well. Sanket, we'll take you through that. So this was uh, pretty much on expected lines that after a cabinet reshuffle, there will be a reshuffle or a rejig as far as the cabinet committees are concerned. Largely because in a large quantity, you had many sitting ministers having to resign. So let's take a look at what is happening. There are many new entrants as far as cabinet's political affairs committee is concerned. Uh, Smriti Irani, Bhupender Yadav and Sarbananda Sonowal are among the new entrants as far as this committee is concerned. They were not there earlier. Now, this has been possible or made possible because on the Cabinet Committee on Political Affairs, Mr. Ravi Shankar Prasad and Dr. Harshwardhan were there. Now, of course, since they are not in the Cabinet, that's why they are not in a Cabinet Committee as well. So this was on expected line. So there was a vacancy and certain people were elevated. Now, uh, there are many other uh, Cabinet Committees also. For instance, the Parliamentary Affairs. In the Cabinet Committee on Parliamentary Affairs, you've got Viren Kumar, Arjun Munda, Kiran Rijiju, as well as Anurag Thakur who have been elevated. Again, in this same committee, Mr. Ravi Shankar Prasad and Prakash Javadekar were there. So uh, it, it's their absence which has led to an, an, uh, an elevation of many new ministers in this particular uh, standing committee. Now, let's quickly tell you the significance of... Uh, of, of this rejig. There is a great amount of significance also attached with certain names who have been given preference in the various cabinet committees. Let's first talk about the big elevation of Sarvananda Sonowal upon his return to the cabinet. Now, if you recall, Sarvananda Sonowal was a, a prominent figure. He, uh, he in fact, uh, sacrificed his position as the chief minister for Himanta Biswa Sarma so that elevation was given to him not just in the cabinet but also in the cabinet committees. Smriti Irani is part of a political committee uh, which is just ahead of the UP elections. She defeated Rahul Gandhi from Amethi. So uh, this elevation is very, very significant. Then Bhupendra Yadav, remember he's a troubleshooter for the party, the organization's man and his expertise in troubleshooting could be used uh, in the arena of political affairs as well. So that's why he finds a mention there. Uh, and last but not the least, big expectations from Anurag Thakur, who has received a huge uh, elevation and has also uh, been made in charge of crucial ministries like sports and Ministry of Information Broadcasting. He's also uh, found a prominent place as far as uh, the Parliamentary Affairs Committee is concerned. So important rejig and uh, realignment as far as Modi's men and women are concerned. So they get a prominent position in parliamentary committees as well.